Happening this week, the Pet Expo is underway at the Orange County Convention Center. It's where people in the pet industry go to learn about the hottest new pet items. This morning, we're joined by Dana Humphrey. She is known as the Pet Lady. Great to see you once hey, again. Welcome morning. back. Thank All right, you. who are our friends here? Well, this is Buttercup. And okay. Buttercup is ready to go green for St. Patrick's Day. I see his little that. Jelly Belly's outfit here. Yeah, and I'm his brother, Lucas. Lucas has a Dressed bow tie. for the occasion with his yeah. bow tie and his gold pot series. <laughs> uh, a little. Little green outfit there, and they want to get That's carried cute. away. This is actually um, an eco friendly pet carrier. Okay, what makes it eco friendly? It's made from recycled plastic bottles. Yeah? Yeah, and so it's a great way to travel in style while also saving the planet. It's really fun to go green for St. Patrick's Day and have a lot of oh, um, fun and festivities, but we also want to think about going green and so saving fun. the planet. So we have some fun, cool stuff. Things that um, can do that. Yeah, what, okay, so what else did you find? You have so much stuff here, we got about a minute to get through. Um, what else you got for us? Well, um, the bamboo training pads are great because bamboo is actually a really durable um, ingredient that when your dog goes to the bathroom, it's an eco-friendly option um, and they're recyclable. So you can check that out for dog training. Um, something that else is really fun is a screen toy. It's a hammerhead um, tug toy uh, from Poflex. <laughs> That's cute. And, you know, for the parades and for the, the different things, you want to check out some costumes, but the costumes are good for a picture, right? And then you want to think about sensible options. Um, like, this is a great option for your dog to wear, like a little cute little green bandana. That's cool. A little um, handkerchief there from Twigo Tags. That's easy. So that's oh, an the easy Twigo. one. You brought those in last time, those yeah. little uh, ID tags. That was yep. good stuff. And now it's like a handkerchief style. Cool. Yeah, so that's fun. And if you're going to give your dog a treat, you know, you want to check out Caleb's Organics. These are awesome. They're uh, made in the USA, non-GMO, organic, natural. Okay, I gotta ask you this next one. Dog rocks. No <laughs> yeah. more urine burn patches on yes, your grass. How exactly. does that work? So just like you want to drink filtered water, you can take these rocks. They're natural. You just put them in your dog's water bowl, and it extracts the nitrates from the water, so that when your dog pees wow. on the grass, no more burn marks. Interesting. So for St. Patrick's Day, you know, definitely no alcohol goes to the pets. Right. Another great option, you can take um, like a little bouillon cube, like a vegetable bouillon, and put it in your dog's water um, and mix it in. So it's a fun little like treat. For them, that's not alcohol related. Okay. And if your pet gets stressed out by the loud noises, the bagpipes, and all the fun stuff going on with the um, St. Patrick's festivities, Pet Remedy is a great option. It's a natural solution uh, made from sage, vetiver, and valerian, and you can just actually just spray it right in your dog's water bowl. Oh, cool. Um, or in this case, your um, your cats, or you can just spray it right on them. And it's just a natural thing. It helps like naturally soothe them and calm them down. Okay. So Very that's a cool. great option for. All right, right time. What's the beer here for? So you know, no beer for dogs, but yeah. you can definitely celebrate and give beer to your friends. So we're gonna give a beer to Who's David here. And, we just wandered uh, in. He's gonna help celebrate St. Patrick's Day <laughs> with a nice Guinness. Who are you? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, he joined us on the show. Hey, what's your website, in case? Check uh, out thepetlady.org. Thepetlady.org. Wow, and he's still going over there. That's impressive.